Hi, I'm Scott Malberg. I'm the Director of Instruction here at Stadium Golf Center in San Diego. And what I'd like to talk to you today about is how to teach the hands what to do through impact. The mistake that I see with a lot of players is they have a tendency to scoop behind the golf ball. And what I mean by that is their hands are behind the ball at impact, which effectively puts the bottom of the swing behind the ball. They hit fat shots initially, and then they might hit thin shots because they lift up with the body or fold their arms through impact, which causes thin shots. What I'd rather see you do is lead with the handle through impact, and here's how you want to do that. When you strike the shot, you're, gonna, you're going to use, first of all, you're going to use a very lofty club like a sand wedge. Make the, start with the club an extension of your left arm. You're going to swing back very short, and when you finish the swing, the club will actually be shooting out of your left arm on the follow through. The key to this drill is to make sure that you correct your finish if you don't get it quite right when you actually strike the ball. So here's an example of that. If I hit the shot, and I have a little scooping action, change it. That's teaching your hands what to feel on the follow through. You'll find that the more you do that, the less you have to change, and eventually you really have a feeling for taking the loft of the club off the ball through impact and have your hands leading. That's essential for making sure you can really strike the ball the way you'd like to off the ground, and that's called compressing the ball, which is striking down on it. I hope that helps you hit the ball first without hitting the ball fat.